You That's know. crazy, bro, because I did I struggle with that. Because right. I definitely care what people think about me. Nah, nah. Because I know people don't even know what they really think about themselves. People are who they are. You understand me? And one of my sayings is that's just their programming. People go react to how they react. Whatever is going to be in every level of success is going to create a new reaction in another person. Because you are someone else's environment, right? And people react to environment. So for me, it's like what another person thinks of me don't matter. It, and my more so thought process is how good am I projecting who I really am to the world? How good am I projecting who I really who am, I to, really the world? am to the world? Because we create illusions all the time. We, it's like if I go home and sleep at night and I measure myself by the accomplishments of 19 keys, that's an illusion. That's me filtering myself through an accomplishment so I think, and, and that makes me feel about myself a certain way. People get accomplishment all the time. You get a viral video, hey, I'm now that person. Do you know me? Do you see me for that thing? Mm, Can you I see my it. value through this new illusion I've created? And you have people that just walk around living out their illusions. And you have to get to a point where, you know, you do project an image to the world so that the world can receive and interact with you a certain way. But you have to get to points where you graduate beyond your own illusions. You don't become them. That's what's what you give to the world so they can interact with you properly based on how you want to be received. That's how you design yourself. Gotcha, gotcha. You understand me? So for me, I think about points of redesigning myself and I know how effective I am because I do listen to feedback. Mm. You understand me? I might listen. I, I digest feedback, whether it's in the comments, whether it's in a DM, whether it's a secondhand conversation about me, you know, whether it's comments on YouTube. Those are people telling me what my brand is. You understand mm. me? That's what branding is. It ain't what you marketing what you say about yourself. Branding see. is what other people say about you and what they go take it to other people. Got you. So I've been taking it personally instead of looking at it as feedback. Feedback. I do. So now this is what they think about you. Okay. Where do you want to pivot it? What do you want them to think about you? And what are you projecting to put those filters in people's mind? That's it's right. like you see a woman on Instagram and she's beautiful, right? Makeup, she might have a filter on, right? That image that you got of her is what made the first impression in your mind. So if you see her in person and she doesn't look like the image, the filter that you have, there's a disappointment, but then it also lends this credibility to where you keep seeing the image more than you see her for real. Mm. You understand me? Because that's what you fell in love with is the idea and the feeling of what this image produced for you, right? So we have a, a, a interesting false reality because we're getting data points from Instagram and that's building up the images that we think about the people that we interact with. But that doesn't mean that that's them. That's what they're doing to feed the algorithm for success. Wow. 